In this Fusion 360 video, I'd like to talk about how to break the link of a projected sketch. In this model, we have two components, number one and number two. Now, if you notice, if I change the sketch of the first one from four to six, the second one will follow it. That's because the sketch of the second one was projected. During the projection of the geometry of the edges, I left on the project link checkbox. Now if you don't want the two components or bodies, other components linked, take that check off. But what if you want to break it after the fact and you did project the link? Let's go through that. So I'm in the second sketch. I'm going to go to isometric so you can see it better. If you hover near the line, you'll see a little symbol come up. If you hover over that, you'll see that it lights up the line in the background in black. That's showing the projection symbol. To get rid of that projection, just simply pick on that icon and hit delete on your keyboard. Notice the line now is white. And it's not constrained. You can do that for all the lines you want to. Just delete them by simply pending delete on your keyboard. There's no right click for this. Just use your keyboard. Okay, so now before you leave here, remember this sketch is no longer constrained in any way, shape, or fashion. So you might want to drop some dimensions on it. I'll put some quick dimensions on it. You also can use constraints if you want to. Go ahead and finish your sketch. Let's go back and modify the first sketch and see what happens. So I'll change this back to four and you can see that the second component does not update. So I broke the link with the little icons. Hope this helps you do better sketching.